You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! Shaking Man, it's your girl Ash Cash, 15 Minutes of Fame, Trap New York, Punchlines of Politics. Uh-huh. Who I've got in the building, man? I'm gonna let these ladies introduce themselves. Start with my left side. You know what it is, man. Boys take <laughs> fame. Get my grub on. Uh-huh. Yep. Oh, I thought it was gonna be a crazy one. Okay. Hey, is your girl Miss Tosh? I ain't stopping the Queen of Queens. We out here. Jazz the rapper. Jazz the onesie. Two Z's. One Z. She ain't even hear me. Yo, so um, right now we at Dave and Buster's, man. We just chilling right now. Um, we got a little bit of stuff to talk about. Well, we got a lot of stuff to talk about. A lot, a little bit, a little bit, a lot. Whatever. Um, female battle rap. I, I don't know what you guys think about it. I know what I think about it. Um, I feel like. You know, it's a, it's a lot to be talked about, so I pretty much just want to hear the girls, um, what the girls think about what's going on with female battle rap, you know, so I'm going to ask you ladies, um, where do you guys think female battle rap is as of now? I mean, anybody could chime in, it's no, not for anybody specifically, so. Um, I definitely think it elevated a lot. I haven't really seen anything that really, well, recently that really wowed me. Um, the last thing that I was really like excited about was um, 40 and E Heart. I'm a fan of them both. Um, I definitely think they, well, 40, I think she's definitely like top as far as the words, like the lyricism. I mean, her performance is not always the best to me, but I'm always excited to see her because I know she's going to bring something unique as far as her words. E heart, she always gives me that gutter feel that but she still got bars though, you know what I'm saying? But I, I was excited about that. That was like the last thing I seen that I was like wowed about. Um but yeah, I, I think that is it's tough though, being a woman at rap period. It's tough being a woman period. But uh like I think female battle rap is definitely on the incline. We just gotta keep we definitely just gotta keep pushing like it's gonna be struggles with the anything, especially in the industry of music, period. But it's about persistence, it's about growing, and just if this is what you want, keep going for that shit. Like, Jazz. Jazz, you over here snapping this macaroni, girl. Oh, that's 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 This is Lil Fizz. Yo, you gotta come say hi. Hey, sorry. You know what? Now you wanna be shy. Alright, fine. Um. So Jazz over here snapping this little nasty ass macaroni burger she got. Why you why you making her burger be? Jazz! What you think about female okay. battle rap? Besides the food right now. Nah, um <laughs> Thank that's you. Savage. Like the way that you were just looking at it didn't make no sense. Female battle rap? <laughs> nah, Tom, she kinda uh summarized it like it's way bigger than it was five years ago when nice. we started. When we started, we all started around the same time. Um, but, like she said, the last event was maybe four or five months ago, and nothing great came out from that event, so I can't really remember the last female battle I've seen that was really good. Um, I don't know what it is, because there are a lot of really good new girls, mm-hmm. but sometimes those battles will be one-sided. Like, it'll be a girl that was really, really good, but her opponent wasn't that good. So, it's right. just, so it's it like, doesn't equal a good battle, right. you know? Um, but it's, it, I feel like people battle rap is it's in a weird spot. Because there hasn't been an event in so long. Like, longer than usual. We don't have, Queen of Ring doesn't have many events a year, but it's, it's been a while. And you're not really hearing anything. You know, like, you can get speculations, or you'll hear, oh, there's a card coming up, the whole card is. Is hindering because female battle rap has grown over these last five six years. 
but it, I feel like it's also at a fault. What do you think is hindering female battle rap from elevating? <clears throat> well, um, I don't see the same. <laughs> Maybe because I'm in it, you know, being like in it, like, you know, having to do with moving it forward. So, you know, I had to kind of double back and, um, with all the slack of using newer girls, I mean, using older girls. The last event we just had, which was about about a month ago, um, it was mainly new talent because I'm trying to, you know, more new talent at the same time. Um, you know, building a building a new lead, you have to get newer talent. So what happens is, I don't see it as a, as a halt. I just think that people, including battle rappers, need to need to like give new talent a try. It's the same thing that the guys go through. Like there are a lot of girls out there, and you, you guys are gonna see. We had three dope. It's, it was like five battles, but we had a couple of dope you know girls that actually had names from had names, but you know, kind of from other places, right? A lot of girls came to New York from um, the Midwest, from you know, the West Coast, from down south, from like the DMV. And I think that what happens is the culture where they if it the culture kind of gets always. The culture kind of like makes it come to a halt because you, you want to see the girls that are bigger or the guys that are bigger but not see the newer talent. And so the reason why it may seem like that is that, um, you know, BCBL is at a point right now where we're, we're like, not, not back to the drum board, but kind of doing new talent. So we're not dropping, you know, battles that I guess that people want to see, but you won't know until you see the battle. Right. And you won't know until you see that, okay, there are some new hungry girls. I think, I don't look at it like, it, like it's dying. I don't think battle rap can ever die. It's like saying hip hop will die. Right. You know, it can't die because it's an art form. You know what I mean? We control them. And battle rap, we control. You know, you have to see this thing. You follow me? Like, no. everyone is, but like, we own it, so we're moving it forward. I disagree you know because when I got back into battle rap, first I was into a Smack DVD. That was into like 2005. I, there was nothing going on with battle rap until grind time, and that was like 2009. So then it died. Nobody was, no, it was nothing going on. It died, and then it came back to life, which leads us to where we are now. I mean, uh, why do you think? But I don't look at it as dying. Yeah, well, I don't think dying. that's like. I so think what every is? genre has its low. It's low exactly. Points. Battle rap has been through a million low points. Exactly. You know what I mean? But just like I, I was just asking Jazz, like. Why, if, it's, if it died or if it's at a home, it's because we are uninspired. The rappers are uninspired. It has to be bad. But why are we uninspired? Let me ask you this. So, hold on. We, we got a new guest coming in here. A late guest. I was about to say, put your light. You want to put you on blast. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Yo, what's, up? what's up, guys? <laughs> Yo, you can introduce yourself. It's Miss Miami. Y'all know the rest. <laughs> I'm about to say, you're not going to drop the slogan no, on they know, they know what's up. Oh, new slogan, right. new slogan coming soon. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, if you want, um, you can get a drink. If you want to get something to eat, you can get something out of there. Uh, you can join in. Uh, like I said, yo, we at David Buster's right now. We're chilling with Mac in. Um, all right. All right, let me ask you guys this because, like you said, you're grooming new talent. We got new talent coming in. Five years ago, like 2011, when I started, like female battle rap was on a super spring. Why is it that the new girls that we have now are not creating that super spring that the the jazz, the the Shayna Ashley, the, the it's intimidating and everybody don't have talent. That's not it. I, I feel like no. Here's the thing. As an owner too, right? I feel that first of all, URL. If you look at URL. They create stars. A lot. Of, it's always this. It's always this argument of artists versus platform. And you always ask yourself, you know, um, the artist always feels like they put themselves on. But no, the platform—it's a 50-50 thing, kind of. Right. The platform needs the talent. Right. But honestly, the platform is at a certain. 70-30. Huh? I think it's 70-30 rule. I think it's 70. So who do you think? Who gets 70? The platform is 70. The artist. Nah. Because what is the artist going to do with it? Nah. Make a person have Yeah. Artist. And That's true. Everybody can't be a star. No. Everybody can't. I always tell people Everyone that. Everyone can't be a star, a star, but URL has created stars. 
Right. And well, here's the thing. But they had to already But it wasn't, that everybody, it wasn't cool. everybody that went through URL that became a star. Not everybody, no. Not. But that doesn't mean that it's, it's a, the platform, the artist, the artists are going to shine everywhere, not just on URL. Yes, exactly. If they take it to, if they're on URL, you're thinking as and artists, not as business people. You're thinking as an artist. No, because, okay, so what did, what, what star. Let me finish my point. I'm saying, what's going to be? Face the point. And my, when I, anal, I analyzed female battle rap before I got into the ownership side. And what I noticed is that I used to say, okay, did these girls just have the talent and were already stars and that platform gave them a boost. And that's what I think. But real, real talk, the, real, if you look at, you analyze female battle rap from 2010 till now for females, what has changed? No lives have been changed. URL has changed. changed. Exactly. No, no, no. I'm saying no. Changed. Think in terms of business. URL has changed lives of the battlers. But they URL and Queen of the Ring don't do the same thing. They URL don't. Though, but they throw battles. I mean, they throw events. They are. They throw events. They're not way the same. More often. I wanted you to say they're not the same. They that's throw events point. way more often. But but that's my point. The point of the the onus on the platform is to make stars. So that's what made me think. Did these girls already have star quality and all they did was get a look from the book from the platform? But real real talk, if the girl has star quality, right, the platform supposed to give supposed to make you skyrocket. Right. If the platform is not aiming to make you a star, you're not gonna necessarily be a platform. But what I mean be a star. You're gonna go as far as the platform goes. That's the problem with female battle rap. I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. That's what I'm saying. You're not gonna go as far as the platform goes if you're a star. No, with females it's different. You have to analyze female talent. For one, females do not. I as a female who goes hard for females, females do. It's only a handful of females that perform at the same level as the men do. This is a fact. And I'm watching the veteran, the OG dudes battle. A lot of girls do not even. Standard, right? So you have to do other things to make female stars. You could be a star already, right? You have star quality, but you're only going to go as far as the platform allows you. You can get millions of followers, but what happens? Why aren't you the breakout star? I feel like URL has honed some of the star quality. They created the stars. These, these like guys went from star to. I feel like comparing the artists is pretty much. Yeah, I feel like it's right. Guys, you can't really. Guys are, are going to get further than girls. It's so, freaked up, though. Period and music, like, it, 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 it is, but I'm, it is. It's, it's, all, it's all being compared, yeah. but that's my point. It's not the same. But I think because a platform has not done what they're supposed to do for females. Okay. You are supposed to. I agree with that. The onus on, that's my, that's my goal. I've only been doing it really for a year and a half. But what do you think? The goal of the platform is to make the star. Yeah, what do you, you think have, the platform And I feel like if that's not your goal to make a star, then why do you that's have these? Exactly. Why do you have the talent? But that's yeah. the problem. But the platform. So what is the platform missing? They're not. They're trying to get money, and they're not trying to make the stars. Right. The stars make the money. You don't right. really make the money. That's, that's my look on it. I feel like what's missing is there's still mad levels that female battle rap has not even seen. Right. And honestly, when I got into the game, that was my goal. I had people attend events that were from Viacom or from certain places to see. They gave an opinion on it. You know, I'm not going to view. I'm not going to voice that opinion, but it has potential. I do believe that the girls will sell, will sell way more than the guys will on television. Right. However, you need the marketability. You need, if I try to tell these girls, I agree with that too. the girls have to come looking like something. You can't just come looking like, first of all, if you're in the beginning, no, I feel like in the beginning though, like when it first, like when, 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 like when Peter Ring first started, you really you didn't, didn't have to look no like, better. you didn't have to look like You didn't know no better though. Like how they were. Right. Even you when know. I started, even you when I started. You tell the artist that. I always tell artists, please, it's in my contract. 
It's in my, I say it, I say, come look, look at like no, self. I, like I, like I know, I say entertainment standard. You don't get that, then it's like, come looking don't dressed. Come in here First looking of all, like women. Everything. But then it's still going to leave it to beauty. But some people don't know, know how to dress. Like, so exactly. they be like, I look like something. Right, and you be yeah, like, so that's true too. That's true, that's true too. A lot of people don't know how to dress. You need a butt, like the platform just needs more of a budget to be able to do those things. I always had a makeup artist on back. Yeah. That's necessary. Some girls don't like it, but it's necessary because it is. for one, women are judged harder. Even if they, I'm exactly. talking about that's a fact. Standard. Oh, right. that's a not fact. No, the comments. Sex sells, bro. Oh, comments. Oh, that's true. Crazy. Miami. What, what, what do you feel like? What do you feel is different? You don't. I, I don't, you don't feel, feel like you have to be. You don't have to be sexy, but you have to be. To me, one time in one of my battles, it was cool, and I had on shoes. It was cool. I was in Miami, but it's uncomfortable wrapping in a dress. I don't know how other people do it. Like I feel stupid. Like it's uncomfortable. I can't move how I want to move in a dress. Like it's you don't have to wear a dress though, but I feel just like you just don't like, look dirty. Right. Like, then you be looking <laughs> crazy, like crazy, and it be like. That's true. Like you just have that, like, First of all, if you're an artist, <laughs> some people show, do do that. Like you're crazy. Like, I mean, yo, I swear to God, when I prepare for a battle, I don't know my outfit before I'm done writing. <laughs> Word. 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 You should. Word. Word. You have to look like, like these new like, girls. Like, because, nah, you gotta, you gotta worry about how you look. That's true. Don't get me wrong. You have to sell your brand. It's hard. Exactly. No, that's everything. You think they care? You have to sell your brand. You have to sell your brand, but your brand goes on to what they you're into. Like, like what you want, what you're trying to and vote for me. Do you feel like you shouldn't have to, do you feel like you shouldn't have to dress a certain way? I feel like you can dress however you want to dress as long, well, but. Even dirty? Don't look dirty, don't look like you just rolled out. No, you're not dirty. No, you shouldn't look dirty. But you're I'm sorry, you're to I feel like you should look presentable, but everybody is not in the same predicament. Everybody's not up. Yeah, like, you know, that's true. That's true. But, that's I mean, you know, I like style. I like swag. I love that shit. So, of course, I'm going to tell you to, you know, pull your best shit out. But everybody's not in that predicament that's to do true. so. That's true. So, if, if you are the brand and you're selling your yourself. brand, exactly, but you don't know everybody's predicament. That's like, true. That is true. That's true. I mean, but, I mean, some people don't got it to keep it. We have this expensive. Some people don't. 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 Nah, you're I don't care what nobody say. Women got the cheapest clothes on the fucking planet. Exactly. That you don't have if it's not a part of you. Because okay. you can put this dress okay. on and look like. It sounds like excuses. It's not an excuse. I'm going to give it any dress. I'm talking about what. Okay. Like, it's not only. No, here's the thing. Yeah, that's that may be all fine and well. No matter what your situation is, any new girl out there, you listening to this right here, you don't have to have a lot of money to look presentable. Come looking presentable. For, you can be confident in what you're saying. Right. You're not. That's you're true. not no, of the course. right. That's okay. That's it. That's it. That's, you can take, buy a t shirt. You, can, you don't have to like. No, but I'm you're mad. mad. I've had people make comments to me like, oh, you should change your hairstyle or you should. Yeah, people say, oh, oh you, you should pay for it. Right. Exactly. Clearly, exactly. Clearly. Don't lose your hat. Right. <laughs> Clearly. Hey. 15 minutes of fame. Oh, that's crazy. You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go. 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Now stepping into 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. 